The Benjamin Graham Formula A Simple Method to Estimate Fair Value The formula first appeared in Graham's seminal book, The Intelligent Investor, which influenced great investors such as Warren Buffett. The Graham formula helps estimate a fair value for a company, allowing for a margin of safety. The Graham formula inputs V equals EPS times 8.5 plus G times 4.4 divided by Y, where V equals the intrinsic value, EPS equals earnings per share, G equals earnings growth, Y equals 30-year AAA corporate bond rate, where earnings are best normalized over at least five years, and earnings growth can be either either historical or an analyst. An example of fair value using Aflac. Aflac's current price equals $45.30. Normalized earnings equals $4.71. Historical growth rate of earnings equals 6.59% and the current AAA corporate bond rate equals 2.8%. Value equals 4.71 times 8.5 plus 6.59% times 4.4% divided by 2.80%, which gives us a historical value of $111.69, an analyst growth value of $78.97 based on an analyst gross estimate of 2.17% growth. Some ideas to consider. Fundamentals. The Graham formula doesn't account for assets, liabilities, and free cash flow. It's also the upper range that the Graham formula is meant to show for evaluation of growth of value. It's only meant to be used as a tool. Graham never meant for the formula to be used for the basis of stock selection. Rather, he established 17 guidelines, which he outlines in chapters 14 and 15 of his book for stock selection for both defensive and enterprising investors. The Graham Formula. To learn more about the Benjamin Graham Formula, please enjoy the rest of the post. Thank you for listening.